Hi, welcome to Math with Brian. My name is Brian. In a previous video, I showed you this problem. What is the sum of 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus etc plus n? If you don't remember the answer, you can pause the video and try this problem. To find the sum, you get two sets of these numbers, but one set is swapped. You add them together and notice that each column adds up to n plus 1. So to find the sum of one set, you take the number on each square on the bottom, multiply that with the number of squares, and then divide by 2, simplify, and you'll get n times n plus 1 divided by 2. So now I have a much harder problem. What is the sum of 1 squared plus 2 squared plus 3 squared plus etc plus n squared? Pause the video if you would like to give it a try and continue if you're ready. We can first expand this equation into 1 plus 2 plus 2 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 etc. We can put these numbers in a pyramid and label the rows. We can make a copy by rotating counterclockwise. The rows are going to be diagonal. We can make another copy by rotating clockwise. The rows are all going to be vertical. Now we add all of them together, but we have to remember to divide our final answer by 3. You can add each tile together at 1, but you'll notice that each tile add up to 2n plus 1. Now, in order to find the answer, we need to find how many tiles that says 2n plus 1 are there. Pause the video if you would like to give it a try and continue if you're ready. Well, in row 1, there's 1, in row 2, there's 2, all the way to row n, and there's n. So what is 1 plus 2 all the way to n? Well, that is n times n plus 1 divided by 2. So to find the final answer, we take the number on each square, multiply that by the number of squares, all divided by 3. We can simplify, and we get 1 third n cubed plus 1 half n squared plus 1 six n. That's the end of this video. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next video.